Hi friends, welcome to Exams Daily English. Today in this video, I would like to share you about the latest job requirement which was released by Indian Army. Before that, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and click the bell icon for current updates. Army requirement rally will be conducted on 2 December 2020 to 12 December 2020 at Ravdularam Stadium which is situated in Haryana State, Rivari for the post of soldier tradesman category. They have said that the eligible candidates from the districts of Ambala, Kaithal, Karnal, Kurukshetra, Yamunanagar and Panchkula and Chattingar are uh, invited for this post they have also said that for this rally you have to do an online registration which is a mandatory one it will be open from 3 october 2020 to 16 november 2020 and the admit cards for this rally will be sent through your register email from 17 november 2020 onwards so if you had a passion of joining in the indian army you can apply for this and it is a golden opportunity which was given by indian army they have also said some of the criteria and the guidelines which should be followed while coming for this value also and they have given the qualitative requirements also uh, they have said that for the category of soldier tradesmen you should have an age your uh, birth dates inclusive and your minimum physical qr and your education qr has also been mentioned if you want to join this the official pdf link has been given in the description box so that you can uh, get more and further details about this and they have also given the special physical standards also for indian gurkha for tribals of authorized tribal areas and they have given some of the relaxation in physical standards also so uh, the height chest limit and the weight has also be given for the outstanding sportsmen also some of the relaxation has been given so you can check through it and next they will be testing on your basis of physical fitness test in the rally site itself so you have to do an 1.6 kilometer run beam pull ups and nine feet ditch zigzag balance also in the rally site only you will be qualified and your remarks will be given by the army authoritative only and the physical measurement will be held on rally sites itself they have given that para to above only have will be listed in the shortlisted one and next they have given the medical test also medical standards will also be measured so that you will be checking for the skill also and your health status also and next if you are selected and if you have been nominated you will be asked to attend the written test which is a common entrance examination CEE uh, if you are nominated you will be selected on the rally site itself and the admit card for the CEE will be given on the rally site itself so if you are a fit candidate you will be selected for the next stage of this uh, post and uh, your review fit cases will be issued at ARO Charki Dantri after getting medically fit by consent specialist only so you have to be very conscious about that and next they have asked the candidates who are coming for the rally uh, you have to bring some of the documents and the certificates in the original only and you should have two attested photocopies while you are coming for the rally site first one is they have asked you to bring the admit card you have to bring the admit card it should be in a printed on laser printed on a good quality paper and don't shrink the size and also avoid these type of uh, shrinking uh, work also and next they have asked your photographs that is you have to bring your passport size photo you have to take 20 copies of your unattested uh, passport size color photographs it should be developed on a good quality photographic paper and if you do some of the computer printouts or if you have done some of the photoshopped photographs it will not be accepted so please keep that in mind and while you're going for that you have to take 20 copies of your unattested passport size color photographs and next is the education certificates you have to take the original only you have to take your all educational qualification achieved certificates uh, it may be your metric intermediate or graduation level uh, with from your recognized school college board or your university you should have to take all of these and your provincial online education certificate should be certified ink signed by the head of the educational institution so if you have completed any of the online education you have to take that also and you have to bring your nativity 
domical certificate uh, through that you will be coming to know that you are belonging to the this type of nativity so you have to take that it should be issued by tahsildar and district magistrate only so you have to take that and next you have to take your caste certificate also uh, you have to take your photograph in that also so please keep that in mind and next you have to take your religion certificate also um, and next your uh, school character certificate your character certificate your unmarried certificate also if you are not uh, married you have to take your unmarried certificate and you have to get your relationship certificate also the certificate should be in original and you have to take two photocopies two attested photocopies so please keep that uh, that in mind and your sports certificate through this sports certificates you will be getting bonus marks and uh, uh, for which the candidate will be screened also so you have to take your register number and from the government recognized sports institute or bodies as under only so if you are having uh, any of these uh, sport recognized sports institutes or bodies you have to take these certificates also so it will be more valuable for you and it will get more bonus marks for you also and next is your certificate of bonus marks that is you have to take all your original certificates so that you will be getting your bonus marks and they have also asked you to bring your single bank ac and pan card and aadhar card so that you will be coming to know that you belong to these type of uh, nativity so it is very important and they have given some of the special instructions also if you are a candidate who have completed the ncc you can bring your certificate also uh, producing of fake certificate will be dealt severely so please don't that and please avoid that because it is a very illegal one so please don't do that and next is the if you are allowed to take part in one category only during the recruitment rally only so you have to keep that in mind and next they have given some of the instructions for attending the rally also you have to report at 3 am at the entry gate of the rally ground because punctuality is very mainly followed in our indian army so you have to be there at 3 am and uh, the gate will be closed at 9 30 am every day so be prepared and be punctual while coming for the rally and next your usage of mobile is strictly not allowed in the rally site or in the written exam premises so please avoid these and next if you are a married candidate below 21 years of age you are not eligible for enrollment into the army so please check through it and uh, they have also given uh, candidates not in possession of requested certificates are reliable for rejection if you are producing some of the fake or uh, illegal documents you will be rejected and your application will also be rejected so please keep in mind and be avoid to the and please don't do these things and next they have given the bonus marks uh, list also if you are producing these types of uh, certificates or if you are belonging to these types of category you will be given extra bonus marks so if you want to know more about this you can check through it and next they have given some of the important instructions also if you want to apply for this you have to go to the official website www.joinindianarmy.nic.in so that you will be getting your admit card details and your uh, further information also regarding this so please follow them regularly so that you will be getting more information and they have also given some of the criteria and the guidelines which should be followed in the rally site and your eligibility also so for more details you can uh, contact on the telephone number which was given by them so you can get through it and the terms and condition which is given in the notification are subject to change and uh, it may be changed or it may not be changed so please check through it and they have also given the format format for affidavit so if you are applying for this you should take this format only if you are belonging to SOS, SOEX, SOW and SOWW. Uh, if you are belonging to these four categories you have to take this format only. So if you are belonging you can check through it. If you had a passion of joining in Indian Army it is a very good opportunity and it will be a more golden opportunity for you. So don't miss this opportunity and all the very best from our team you will be selected if you have these eligibility criteria and if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and click the bell icon for further details thank you